know how I feel right now? I know exactly how you feel right now. I feel like beating somebody's ass right now. Yeah. I feel like beating somebody's ass right now. The way just like through the frustration like beating somebody's ass right I know, now. I know, I know. You know what I'm saying? Like I see anybody, yo, anybody rub me off the wrong way, no diddy today. I'm beating they ass today, bro. I'm so mad, bro. I'm I know, I know, I know, I know. But we always have to look at things in like a <laughs> like a positive mindset, right? You can't be negative because then the situation will turn out negative. Today is actually a very special day, mm -hmm. but kind of getting messed up the way with things is going. But pretty much today is our moving day. June 27th is our moving day, which is today. Closing day. Yeah, closing day. We were hinting um, to you guys so much about like it was the end of the month. Da -da 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 -da. Today's yeah. the day. And unfortunately, some, you know, BS happened. Some more BS and some more BS. Pretty much, it was honestly just saying, like, listen, the 27th is not going to be your closing day. It's going to be later. So yeah. basically, we're going to explain way more. Before we close today, um, we were supposed to go do our final walkthrough of the house mm -hmm. and then go to the office, do the paperwork, get the keys, and then the house is ours. We're actually going to go to the house to do the final walkthrough. Yeah, last week, exactly one week ago today, we did our blue tape walkthrough and we walked through the entire house. Literally, what, like four hours? Bro, we still got the blue tape back here. Or something. Oh, I, I had put it in uh, the yeah, back. The clipboard right yeah, the here. Clipboard, the, the checklist, tape, everything. The checklist, everything is still here. Yeah. In the car. We did that last week. We blue taped up the whole house. We were expecting to move in one week later, like Cam said. And unfortunately, we are not, obviously. We're still going to go do our final walk right now. And then, whenever the closing day does happen, we'll just have to go do the paperwork and whatnot. Honestly, but. I have to get off my chest. All I got to say is, I do not like the IRS. Trisha does not like the IRS. Bro, a lot of people do not like the IRS. It's a message out to the IRS. If you put a hit on somebody's head saying, listen, you owe us money for not paying your taxes, you guys get it done right there and then. If we the people need shit from you guys, you guys take forever ever bro like mm -hmm. you guys are in cp time worse than now CP listen time. be careful what you're saying because you don't want to get on anyone's bad side irs we appreciate everything actually wait wait wait, hold on, wait, 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 wait 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 hold on let me because there might be some people who work for the irs okay wait majority of the irs is on some bs but there is a very light selection of people who work for the irs who They're is actually very helpful very helpful very outstanding at their job you guys need to be promoted and you need to get rid of the people of the people who ah bro you know what i'm saying we're like, gonna get into the whole situation yeah. but we we have a lot to tell you guys about. You guys have been fiending for a house update. We've been waiting to give you a house update when we had an update and that is today. So we're gonna go to the house. We're gonna take you guys with us. I don't know how much we're gonna show you of the final walkthrough because there's not really much for you guys to see without a house tour, but we're just frustrated right now that we're not packing up the U-Haul today along with going for this walkthrough. So. Yeah, all games to the, to the side of IRS, you know what I'm saying? Let's help us out. We're trying to give you more money by paying taxes on a house. So it's like, Facts. come on. But let's just get to the house, okay? Yeah. Let's, Let's get go. to the house. <laughs> All right, guys. So we are back home. We did our final walkthrough with the house. We're not going to explain too much and sit here and just yap, 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 mm -hmm. yap. But we're going to kind of explain to you guys exactly what we've been going through and pretty much what's going on with our closing and everything and um, pretty much how our closing got pushed back yeah. instead of it being today. First things first, something that we really haven't talked about is the fact that we kind of should have been moved in the house already going all the way back of the month of march we should have been living in the house but the reason why we haven't was because we were waiting on the electric company around here be on board and do the electric for the whole entire phase of like new houses that was being built and stuff like that so projected to be done march then it got pushed back and then it got pushed back and it got pushed back and pushed back so we were dealing with that i don't even think we told you guys that but that was stressing us out like crazy and then our house got pushed back so much that it fell into the next year of closing well of taxes well of taxes yeah and then we had to file for like new taxes for those that don't understand because we're self-employed and we right. have a business and things like that there's a lot of different procedures being used and that you have to go through when it comes to taxes as a business owner so that pretty much like just pushed us back we finally got all that straight away and then as the process um this could be boring to a lot of people but it's as the process of <laughs> um you know find your loan for your mortgage for the house and everything you know that's a whole entire process because you want to find a company that's good for you you know you want to look at the interest 
you know what I'm saying? You want to make sure everything Points. is good for you and you know your your financial position and everything found one went through with everything and then we get hit with just a lot of just crazy requirements that we needed that we have been trying to get but unfortunately to wait longer than usual because of the irs and a lot of people are just like I guess filing taxes and getting their taxes and paying, sending payments in for their taxes and stuff like that. Information that we need to finalize a lot of stuff and close is on like a wait right now, mm -hmm. which it's been on a wait that, you know, our closing day was today and we're still waiting on some for, uh, for some information from the IRS. So we went past our closing day now. Well, it's our closing day now. We're still waiting for this our information. Our appointment is literally three minutes ago at the closing office. Yeah. So, yeah, it's pretty tough for us because, you know, we were so happy for today to close on our house. You know, we were just so excited prior for from us knowing like, oh, we might go past our closing day. We were talking about like, we're so excited to get the keys. You know, I'm going to sleep in the I was saying, yo, I'm sleeping in the house. Once we get the keys, I don't care if there's no air in there. No Why would there be no air? Like, <laughs> I'm sleeping in that house. You know what I'm saying? It's super exciting. Keys to your house, your first house, especially the house where your family is gonna grow and grow and grow. A lot of memories that's gonna be created in there. So I was just super excited, super excited. I don't care, I'm sleeping on the floor. I don't care. And it really stinks when you tell a lot of people, you know, your closing, day, it's our closing, your closing day. day is this day. Yeah. And then something happens and then you wind up not closing. And then and you have to explain everything, everything to everybody that you told. Yeah, and it's just annoying because it's like, that's one thing Cameron and I do. We do not like to say things too soon, which is why when we did the video where I was telling Cam, about the closing date and stuff like that we didn't share it with you guys just in case there was a little like delay or something like that but we don't know how long this delay is like it could be two weeks it could be a month we're hoping obviously that all the information is magically sent to us later on today we can close by next week but you guys have been asking for updates of like moving content and like all that stuff but i'm not even joking guys every single day i am doing something Girl, regarding every single day this mortgage and like getting this information we're calling IRS. The only thing that we need, we just need confirmation. That's yeah. all we we need confirmation, bro. That's the only. It'd be so nice if we knew someone like who is high up in IRS, and we were like, "Yo, we really need this information for for us to close in this house. Can you please just yeah. send it to us right now, so we know that we're getting it in the mail this week?" Yeah. So I'm gonna just be honest. Literally, what they need confirmation of is us paying our taxes. That's literally what it is. We submitted a very large payment to the IRS paying off our taxes and we just need confirmation of that. Not only that, and but it's just a pending payment on there and the money's out of our account. We have the statements to show the mortgage company. We have everything, but they just can't accept like a screenshot of that. That's the thing Because right it's there. saying pending on the IRS website. We need them to like process that payment and have it confirmed and then send us the agreement. I don't know what postage the IRS is using, that it takes 21 days for us to get mail or whatever it, it is. Sometimes they're talking about 90 days, sometimes yeah. they're talking about 60 days. I'm the like, thing is, is that someone walking it by foot to my mailbox? For real, we are on a time crunch, bro. We need this information. Yeah. It's just confirmation, literally just confirmation. We're only waiting on confirmation and then we can close. But that's exactly why like when you guys are saying like, where's the moving content, da da da. Mm -hmm. Honestly, we haven't, I'm gonna be honest, we haven't packed anything yet. We have not packed one thing. We've been decluttering, but we have not packed one thing. We almost feel Feel like we've been battling this for so long that we don't want to pack things up and have boxes laying around for now look possibly two weeks to a month an extra two yeah weeks. like it's just it's too much and like there's just so many things that are like backed up because of this like cameron's grill delivery for example i had to postpone that like that was supposed to be delivered in two days from now not only that guys one thing that really stressed us out this is us just ranting to you guys and like telling you guys why we one haven't been posting that much and two why we're not in our house yet we almost were homeless the reason why is because our lease for our apartment ended and we had to sign up for a month to month so that this way obviously we're not signing up for another year like we're not going to be here for another year so we signed up for a month to month and because we had our close date i canceled our month to month so we were supposed to be out of here in the beginning of july we, we would have found somewhere to live okay we would, we would have, have had homeless. some well yeah okay. we would have been kicked out not really kicked out we would have had a move we we'll would have had to that. move okay that was dramatic saying that but anyways what i meant is that we would have to move that was just very stressful for us because we we're like dang now we really got to figure out where the heck we're gonna put all of our stuff three dogs a baby what airbnb is gonna take us for this like it was just a lot luckily i was able to renew our lease and we do have our apartment for another month until 
we figure out what's going on. Well, yeah, like Trisha said, uh, it is stressful. It's very stressful. Our heads be in like the different like zones and yeah. stuff in and out, in and out, down there to over there to right here. You know what I'm saying? It didn't even make any sense everything I just said, but that's where no, our but brain. No, it does make sense. That's where us. our brain is like. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Our brain is just like off the rails right now, and it really is discouraging us from a lot of things. Even just like for me, personal like personal things. Even for her streaming. You no, know, this has been very stressful. It's literally like a kid waiting for their parent to do the transaction for the candy, like at the candy store. I always love you, your metaphors. You just wanna like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like you sit in there, you're like, come on, like I just want my candy. Or you buy a video game and you can't wait to get home to pop it in and play it. It's, it's just like, been dangled in front of us for so long. We're sitting here. We're yeah. ready, like Our we're just waiting. We're waiting, we're checking the mailbox every day. Calling the IRS every single day. We're just waiting for the confirmation, trying to get it any single way. It's so strict, bro. They can't send an email. Iris can't write an email of confirmation. If they send a letter, say, as of today, it's gonna to take 21 days to get here. And then plus since 4th of July is coming up, that's gonna delay things with postage. This might seem like, oh my gosh, you guys are complaining, like you're still gonna get the house and da 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 da. You guys have to understand, this house, it's not just a house for us. Like some people, not to like degrade other people's situation, but some people like, you go house hunting, it's all fun and games, whatever. Oh, you get the keys for your house. Cameron and I already have an emotional attachment to this house. Like some people are like, oh, if you don't get the house, like there's always other houses. Like, no, this is our home. Like we have an emotional attachment to this house already. We have like our names in the walls. Like we saw it literally from dirt, mud, That's up until thing. part it is now. Like we, this is our home. Like we're stressing and we're fighting for like literally what the thing says on our counter. If you can't stop thinking about it, don't stop working for it. Like we are putting in work to make sure this home is ours. Like Trisha said, we built like such a crazy connection to the house. Like we signed, we put our names into the wall. Like we signed Sharpie onto like the wood inside the wall. The house is like our kid. Watch the house grow up to what it's now. Like we were there every single process, bro. Like every single like step, every single you know, milestone it reached of the foundation, the basement's complete, them finishing the first floor, the second floor, putting the sidings on, the roof, windows, painting the inside, everything. We were there every single milestone of this house to it being finished now. Unfortunately, this is what we've been going through. We wanted to tell you guys about what we've been going through. You know, you guys been begging for house updates and stuff like that, moving content, all that stuff. We just don't wanna block any blessings. You know what I'm saying? That's all, we don't wanna, hype everybody up like for example we told you guys from the jump we found out the 27th of june oh my god we gotta go tell them guys we're moving in the 27th and then look now like we can't close today because of this mm -hmm. this and that we just decided enough was enough of like not keeping you guys in the loop with everything because it's been weighing on us mentally it's been weighing on us like it feels good to vent. Like posting, yeah, it does feel good to vent. You guys pick up on things. You guys are like CIA, FBI agents. Haven't you guys been posting? Exactly. You guys, like your energy feels off and it's just Cam, like- Cam, yo, you guys attack me in the comment section. Cam, you look a little bit off. You don't yeah, seem the same. The Cam, da 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 da. Like you guys really be catching on. And, yeah. and well, now you guys know. That's Unfortunately, nice. this is life, guys. No this, mortgage is this, easy. This happens to people. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And and people do get discouraged from situations like this. They get mm -hmm. affected by it. And we are those humans that do. Pretty much, I don't want to sit here and just yap all day. I could too, I mean, you guys. <laughs> Some people probably are not even here in this part right now because no. they were just. They're like, all right, it. you guys didn't get the house. Like, they found out what house. they wanted. They jumped off whatever pretty much that's it right now for the house update we will keep you guys updated okay I would say hey yeah we'll post some vlogs on the vlog channel of us going house shopping for some stuff but, but i don't like, want to gas it no, up no and it's so annoying because it's like what the heck are we shopping we don't even know when things are going to be delivered we're not about to go buy decor for the house and bring it up into our apartment for just another thing for us to move. Okay, like, so this is what we'll do. Once we finally get this information and then we're going towards a closing date and we find out the new one, we'll tell you guys. Right now we are just playing a sitting duck. Game. Sitting duck waiting game. Bro, I would pay, I don't care, I'd pay $2,000 to get those, those letters right now. Like I'd pay that, like, for express mail. Like, give it to me, bro. We will literally drive no to ditty. Washington, D.C. Like, I will literally drive to Washington, D.C. right now. If they said- Is that where it comes from? I don't know. That's what I'm saying. Why can't we even make an appointment? Pull up. I need confirmation. Don't mail it to me. I'm here. Print the paper and give it to me. We can't even get in contact to get a, 
an appointment. Remember we tried? Who knows, bro? Anyways, this is us. This is how our day goes, and this is how time goes. Every by, single day. Every, every single morning, day. Mid day night all day it's just us talking about the information that we need to receive we're gonna close out the video right here we wanted to give you guys a quick slash long in-depth house update our house is ready it looks beautiful it's ready for us it's ready for i'm not gonna say a family it's ready for our family and we're so excited to move in i think that we're gonna appreciate the house way more now even though we did before but now it's just gonna be like any little thing when it comes to this house it's like our baby you know that's so. what i was saying it's like our kid now mm -hmm. but high hopes guys we're gonna get the house i'm saying everything's gonna work out sooner than later we just wait on these mails bro we just wait on these mails but thank you guys so much for hearing us vent here's your house update like i said before once we get our new date we will inform you guys as soon as possible make sure you guys smash that like button subscribe so you can join the journey yeah the journey the, the journey. journey is journeying right now. <laughs> the journey. And with that being said, we love you guys so much. And we'll catch you guys in the next live video. Stay lit. Peace. Peace.